Hi travelers and welcome back. Do you want to know the best thing to do in Feetbaum? Keep watching this video till the end. You won't have enough time to do everything you want to do in Vietnam. There are a lot of natural and historical sites to see, and the local markets are busy and full of great street food and souvenirs to test your bargaining skills. Adventure lovers like to do things like kayaking, cycling, hiking, and bungee jumping, just to name a few. Today we are going to talk about top 10 things to do in Vietnam. But before we start our countdown, please subscribe to our channel, The Travel Boss, and also leave a thumbs up if you want to go here someday. Number 10. Ride the Reunification Express. This phrase refers to any railway line that runs from Hanoi to Ho Chi Minh City. It's a 30-hour trip that shows off the different landscapes of Vietnam and remembers how North and South Vietnam came together again. Even though the train ride takes a long time, it is still interesting to see green paddy fields, small towns, Hanoi's train street, and Da Nang's high van pass. Number 9. Watch a water puppet show. Not everyone has heard of a puppet show where the water is the stage, and UNESCO is right to call it a part of the intangible cultural heritage. Vietnam is the only place where you can see this rare art form. At the Golden Dragon Puppet Theater in Ho Chi Minh City, dragons, fairies, and other strange characters come to life in a four square meter pool with the help of music and lighting effects. Number 8. Exploring the Mekong Delta. Locals call the Mekong River the River of Nine Dragons because it splits into nine smaller rivers in this delta and flows through low-lying areas before merging with the sea. In the delta, life is all about the river. Streams, not roads, connect neighborhoods more than roads do. Number 7. Time Travel Through the Kyu Chi Tunnels During the Vietnam War, the Viet Cong lived and worked in the Kyu Chi Tunnels, which are a large, complicated network of tunnels that are part of a much bigger network of tunnels. It was also used to send food, medicine, and other supplies to the troops. Tourists can now go through the tunnels safely because lights have been put in. They can also eat a simple meal underground, where soldiers must have eaten a long time ago. Number 6. Explore the Imperial City of Hu. Jia Long, who started the Nugent Dynasty, built the Hu Citadel. The Imperial City of Hu is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. It used to have 160 buildings, but only 10 of the most important ones have stood the test of time and the Vietnam War. This place must be seen because of its beautiful architecture and gardens. Number 5. Visit the War Remnants Museum. The War Remnants Museum is one of the most popular places to visit in Vietnam. It is in District 3 of Ho Chi Minh City. It has exhibits in rooms with different themes. You can see helicopters, fighter planes, tanks, and bombs in its yard. Bombs that haven't gone off yet, but have had their fuses cut are kept on display in one part of the yard. Number 4. Gorge on Vietnamese Street Food Vietnamese food is well known in Southeast Asia, and despite what many people think, it is not the same as other Asian foods. Herbs like coriander, spearmint, basil, beagle leaf, and so on are used a lot in Vietnamese cooking. The use of baguettes and pastries shows that the food is influenced by France. Some of the best street foods to try are the well-known banh mi, nem ran, ban bao ban vac, and dalat pizza. Number 3. Cruising in Halong Bay Halong Bay is another World Heritage Site that is a sight to behold. It has many different kinds of landscapes, such as beautiful sandy beaches, islands, ancient lime karsts and islets, and beautiful emerald green waters. Halong Bay is too busy with tourists, so the Vietnamese government is taking strict steps to keep it quiet. Number 2. Shopping in Hoi An Hoi An is a great place to find traditional clothes, jewelry, handicrafts, paintings, and shoes, among other things. All of this for a very low price that doesn't affect the quality of the product. Hoi An is also known for its good tailoring shops, where you can get your clothes made to fit you perfectly. In Hoi An, the central market is the place to buy and sell fresh food and goods. All the shops are easy to get to on foot, 
so you can spend the evening strolling and shopping for souvenirs to remind you of your trip to Vietnam. Number 1. Exploring Phong Nha Caves This is a UNESCO World Heritage Site for no other reason than that it is the biggest cave in the world. It is so big that a whole jungle grows inside of it. The stalagmites that stood at the entrance of this huge cave gave it its name, which means wind and teeth. It also has a lake, a river that runs underground, and water grottos. The view is so amazing that it makes you feel like nature is a miracle. So, these are the top 10 best things to do in Vietnam. Do you agree with our list and think that exploring Phong Nha Caves is the best thing to do in Vietnam? Share your views in the comments section below and don't forget to subscribe to our channel, The Travel Boss. Thanks for watching.